Welcome to the stream! I made two cents from Nintendo. <laughs> from my YouTube channel, alright. We're, we're rolling. <laughs> we, are, we are rolling in it. Dinosaur track. Oh god, I'm just so excited. Ooh, man, let's go. Okay, okay, okay. A sapling. Great. Huh, they didn't say my house looked like a piece of shit this time. <laughs> Bummer. Whatever. Give me my tree. Whoops. Dragon plant. That's what it is. Yeah, how did he not... Or how did they not just be like, Wow, your house looks like a piece of shit. I guess I'll keep this. Whatever. Bop, 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 bop. Knock, knock. <laughs> Alright. I'm made of grass. Hey Yuka. How you doing? You're so funny, Nook. Joey and Mallory. I'm pretty sure those are both ducks. doesn't look as bad as I thought it would. Sure. Gotta get that raffle ticket. Like, so ugly. I don't need your sentiment.
Be a girl. <laughs> What's up, Boris? You don't even deserve flowers. You're just a little asshat. game Kiki. Let's go plant some flowers. Dragonfly. <laughs> oh, Power change. It's <laughs> good to know. <coughs> I'm guessing uh, kids fucked up your hair somehow. the fish. Stuff! Ooh. Ooh, sweet. I got a TV. Bold check shirt. I feel like this is the red and yellow one. Yeah. And no. <laughs> I want my grass shirt. I'm a ninja. I'm covert operative. Agent. Ooh, hello. Mm -hmm. Am I playing on GameCube or Wii? Um, neither. This is actually the emulated. This is actually, yeah, this is being emulated on my uh, computer. <laughs> What's up, fucker? Um, but yeah, Wayne0770, uh, I'm running this through Dolphin. Mm. 
and uh, I have my my GameCube controller <laughs> hooked up to my computer, so it's pretty cool. It's pretty chill. Playing some some super chill Animal Crossing. I don't remember what I was doing. I need to go talk to Yuko for like a comic book or something. Whoops, that's not what I want. <laughs> it's a grass shirt, dude. Get with the times. Isn't this shirt awesome? All I had to do was polish up a giraffe's car. <laughs> Can I link a game with advance to the island? Uh, as far as I know, I can. I haven't tried it yet, though. Um, it's something I've wanted to do, but I just haven't gotten around to it. I might, I might have to do that here pretty soon. I don't know if I'll do it tonight, but I definitely want to do it sometime. Um, from my understanding, you can, though. I just haven't tried. I'd be really sad if I couldn't, because I, I love going to the island. The yeah, island's really cool. <laughs> Wait! <laughs> That's funny. Hambo! What the hell, dude? Do you think it's, like, evil that they named a pig Hambo? <laughs> I think that's pretty bad. Yeah, whatever, dude. This is Happy Tree Friends. Where's my axe? Oh, I don't have it on me. Whatever. I killed and buried one of my neighbors yesterday. Wow! No! God damn it, Rhoda! Why do you always piss off Hambo? Oh, he's not fat anymore. Okay. Whatever. <laughs> yeah, I want your this comic book. Oh my god, Rhoda! This is all your fault. Rhoda the Rainbow Chicken. You're a dork. <laughs> You're just mad because I'm made out of grass. Look. You can't even see me. <laughs> I'm invisible. Occasionally, you can see my face. Yeah, for real though. I, I would hate my life if my name was Hambo and I was a pig. to the zoo. Well, I live at the zoo. See? Look, animals everywhere. Got you. This one's fun, though. <laughs> whoop, 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 whoop. Hey, what is this? Crucial card. I feel like I donated one of those already. I am the zoo. Yeah. You're not wrong. Got enough hair to go around. <laughs> I caught a frog. What, 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 what is it? Ooh. Yeah, you 
you're goddamn right we're gonna swap it. Pick it up. Pick it up. The only person I've ever heard complain about having to go to a, uh, a theme park. <laughs> Just buy one of those, like, misty, uh, fan things. Spray yourself all day. <laughs> Just... I already got that. My house is only slightly better than all the other houses. I hear someone to blow on you. <laughs> uh, <coughs> uh, that's good. <laughs> How big is this TV? <laughs> hello, hello, everybody. We're playing Animal Crossing and we're jamming out to some old school ZTV blues, apparently. <laughs> drop, drop, drop. This reminds me of some shit off of like Fallout or something. Your house sucks! Yeah, my house does suck, <laughs> let's be honest. Uh, it's so beautiful though, look at it. It's so pretty. Look at my inventory. My inventory is like just as good. This thing's so pretty though. Eh, do the stanky leg. <laughs> yes, sir. That's how you do it, right? Dude, my house is a disaster. <laughs> I wish I could put stuff on my TV. Is that a thing? Let's try it out. Wow, disappointment. Uh, my bed is the floor. You see these raffle tickets? Oh, wait. No, I don't want to sleep on that. We'll, we'll, we'll put this in the corner. <laughs> let's, let's move this out of my sleeping area. Alright, alright. Wait, 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 wait. Wait. Wait, wait. Ah, so comfy. Ah, so comfy. Got it. How's my bed? You heard it here first, folks. I actually modeled it after your apartment. I, uh, I stop by every once in a while and sleep there crazy, right? Oh, hello. Hello, Mr. Fish. That's why my butt hurts in the morning. That's great. Yeah, that's it. That's it, dude. You nailed it. Or maybe did I? <laughs> Ayo. Hello, Mr. Rock. Fuck off, Boris. This is mine. I'm surprised I caught that, to be honest. Haha, mm. <laughs> it looks, looks, looks more like a fish than it does a horse. Do you get it? Because it's a barbel steed? Steed? Like pony? I don't think you get it. I quit. I quit. No, but you, you guys, you guys failed me for the last time. God flippin' 
I'm just, I just want my magic rock. I'm not asking for a lot. I'm just asking for my magic rock. do you think I am? Oh, oh, that's a soccer ball. Boom. Oh, oh, bye soccer ball. I'm gonna take it over to these fuckers, see if they'll actually play with it. Nope, nope, go this way. Uh, who's walking nearby? Rhoda, you little fuck. Oh, 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 oh. Hello? Hambo? Yeah, you goddamn right you're gonna play with that. Nope, nope, nope. Stop, stop. <laughs> you're grounded. I'm putting this in front of your house. You're not allowed to live here anymore. Good luck going home. Literally not possible. You're welcome. <laughs> uh, please leave. I don't want to talk to you. I just want to smack this front. That fear of balls. Do they call it spherophobia? <laughs> oh, I'm sure that's a thing. Real fear of like perfectly round objects. <laughs> uh, yay phobias. Alright, consult the almighty Google. How's everybody doing tonight, though? Hope everyone's doing well. Minus Myra, who had orange juice put in her hair. Alright, come on, little fish. Please? Thank you. So pretty. Trypophobia. Oh, that. I actually hate that stuff. Like, if you look up, like, trypophobia images, it that's the sort of thing that, like, makes your skin crawl. <laughs> it just... Because uh, usually it's in skin, too. Yeah, no, that's ew. Yeah, th those. Th th yeah, it's terrible. I don't like even thinking about it. <laughs> yeah, nasty. Nasty! What's up, Mr. Fish? That's right, Mr. Fish, you mine! Dace. Dace is wild! Alright, Mr. Mole Cricket. I don't, I don't want you. I don't want you to sing your, your, your song. I am the famous fashion designer. I am up and coming. Patience. I will not kill everyone in here. <laughs> No! You're gonna watch my stream and you're gonna like it. <laughs> Alrighty, dude. Uh, make sure you don't break your toaster. I hear that happens. <laughs> well, now what? <laughs> what the hell? It's just a big golden tree. Oh, okay, cool.
Wop, wop, wop. You're hilarious, Blathers. I actually really like Blathers, he's funny. <laughs> he's a cute character. What's up? Take this guy. Take take him off my hands. I don't need the Christian cart. That's all I have left. Well, no, I've got the fish and the frog. What do I need this first? I'm <laughs> <coughs> not really sure what the benefit of having a gold shovel is. So, so what? What you saying? <laughs> you weirdo. Okay. Oh, Wendell's coming around tomorrow. Uh, chicken goes quack quack. The more you know. <laughs> yeah, tomorrow. 
Wow. Why don't you have any lost items? I like this pretty gold tree. I wonder if it just stays there forever. It better. Or else. I'm gonna blow up the game. Wow. It's not blocking his house anymore. It's not cool. He's grounded. He's not allowed to go home. How is he supposed to learn his lesson? Tisk, tisk. Please? Please? I just, I just want to find a magic rock. Magic rock. Where are you? Oh, 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 oh. Can you use this one? Ooh, magic rock. Yeah. You sure? Oh my god. You and your man crush on him. <laughs> you weirdo. Trash, trash. I don't even know what this looks like. It's uh, not bad. I don't really like the bulb check. That can go away. <laughs> That can go to hell. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, whatever. I don't know. I don't think I'm gonna keep that. I'm gonna throw it away. I will pick up this money, though. Money! Oh. I made two whole cents today. It only took me three months. Alright. Uh, classic! <laughs> I just made like 14 grand off of a rock. So cool. I remember my mind just being like blown the first time I found the rock trick. I was like, what the fuck is happening? Fish and pole. Alright. Let's take a gander at selling stuff. Kayla, go find people. Make them watch my stream. Oh, Kayla. Kidding, but okay. An organizer. Wait, does she have it? Oh god. Who's got it? I didn't even wasn't paying attention. Kiki, please. What? Did I just not talk to her? I'm tripping. <laughs> what? What is going on?
Just go ahead and sell the shovel. How much a gold shovel sells for? No, I'm gonna give you this. I just worked, worked real hard. <laughs> yeah, there's no point in me having a regular shovel. Then. I love how he won't pay for the gold one. Literally, the whole shovel made out of gold. He won't even buy it. But he'll take his crappy other one back. <laughs> Does that make any sense? Whoops, not my flowers! Oh, God damn it. <sighs> I destroyed my own flowers. What a sad, sad moment. We, we need to have a uh, moment of peace. Town, damn it. Oh, Boris. 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 Boris, where you at? You're inside. Oh, you're not inside. I lied. Hello, Mr. Pig? Good lord, why does everybody want a cherry? I don't have those! really like a day ago she really wanted a fish apparently
money. <laughs> Thanks, Bob. Ran over just to applaud. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Hey, Mr. Fish. Nice! I'll take it. Pretty sure I have Red Snapper floating around in the uh, museum already. God, I hope so. Hello. Okay. Jesus. <laughs> Three in a row. I'm totally okay with that. Oh, no pitfalls yet. That's interesting. I think pitfalls are special items. I don't think they pop up every single day. Fish, fish, fish. Red fish. Green fish. Blue fish. Yep, there he is. Hello. Mr. Fishies. Oh, Boris, Boris, Boris. That's right. What the? Oh, I suck. Mm-hmm. 
What? I just randomly dug up a hundred bells. <laughs> Is that what this does? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> This game is so weird. I'm just gonna dig up the whole world. <laughs> There's money to be found. Oops. Sorry, ground. snap from the ocean. Mm. This is awesome. I'm totally for this. Oh my bad dude. Or did you not are you saying you didn't get one from Twitch? Look! <laughs> yeah, whatever. <laughs> How's it going, soft mark? Oh, that's what I wanted. Damn it. Let's go donate that fish and I can pick it up. Lathers, Take this ugly thing. What's up, Polly? <laughs> How you doing, dude? <laughs> it's a party! <laughs> oh shit, I do not want to pick that up. Just drop that. That bad boy. <laughs> Death by video. Is this the ring? Is this 2001? Realize it, but that was actually based off of a um, like a Japanese movie. Like that's where it originated from, and the ring was actually a a remake of the first one, the Japanese one. <laughs> Crazy! I have a blue, blue koala in my town. I'm kind of the coolest. <laughs> I'm on a mission. 
Actually, should I just buy all this stuff? I'm gonna buy it all. I don't know what the deal is with raffle tickets. Thanks, man. I said it looks nice on me. I have to buy it. So how's everybody doing? I feel like it's been ages. <laughs> I love how I'm just buying this stuff. Just for the sake of, uh... Giving him money so he'll upgrade his place. <laughs> but that's literally the only reason I'm buying this stuff. I don't want any of it. Whoops, I'm not trying to sell. I'm gonna sell stuff in a second, but I wanna buy this thing first. Yeah. I'll probably stream some more rock band sometime. Shit, I mean, uh, uh, I mean, if you want to see them and you have like specific nights that you know you'll be free, I can, uh, you know, finagle my schedule. It's real, it's real clustered, but I, I can make it happen. <laughs> Sometimes it's better to stay busy than it is to be bored. It's actually a pretty catchy little little thing. <laughs> play um, Black Desert with you, sophomore? I didn't realize that. Alright, fish. What the? God. Oh, I got you. Fish. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, I did, definitely did not know that. This fish is breaking my balls. I hate that fish. He's like, yeah, I'm not looking. I'm not looking. That <laughs> was verbatim. That fish just said. I was there. What the? Uh -huh. hmm. Say no to littering, everybody. Whoops, I goofed. Yep, I speak fish. I speak all animal languages. How do you think I can play this game? Oh, oh, oh. I'm gonna ruin this guy's fun. Suck it, Bob! I'm gonna steal your bug! Woo! <laughs> I like how they applaud. It's really funny. 
Oh. Yeah, for real though. Though, you know, Aquaman's super strength probably would come in handy, but, you know, who needs him? Who needs him? God. Well, I suck. I suck. That's what it is. Please? Just, just look at it? Look, look. Uh, that way? Look a little left? Please? Please? Damn it. You stupid fish! <laughs> we need to take him to the desert. <laughs> Rive! <laughs> Struggle! Too, Mr. Fish. Mr. Fish, acknowledge me. I actually really like the way this town is laid out. Like, look at this little, I got like basically a little archipelago type of thing going on right now. Oh, 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 he turned around. He turned around. God, no! Oh, okay. Normally that would uh, scare away a fish. I'm glad it didn't. Gotta get my red snapper. That's my money maker. Oh, no, 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 yep, there we go. Shit. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> right in front of your face this fish is blind dear lord I'm gonna murder this fucking fish murder please please thank you yeah dude I don't know what it is but there's a lot of red snapper going on right now and it is the best thing ever. Yeah, look, look at that. Like, I don't know if I downloaded a ROM that was just like cheated or something, but this, that's a, it's, it's enough red snapper where it's like, <gasps> this is fucking glitched. <laughs> Normally I'd be finding like way more sea bass. Maybe. I don't know. That, this is a lot <laughs> of red snapper, dude. Like no, no exaggerating at all. Like each one of these is three grand. So that's like a twelve grand right there. All right, Mr. Fish. What are you? I mean, maybe it's just a good season for it. <laughs> Red snapper life. That one seems a little too big. <gasps> Me, Red snapper. What is this little guy? Bite me. <laughs> <laughs> Got him. Got him, coach. Put me in, coach. All right, where's this other fish? Oh, there you go. Why don't you turn your stupid ass around? Please? Please? Oh, okay. Okay, yeah, that's cool. It's cool. Just make me run. Run laps. It's fine.
Hell yeah. Ooh, even better. <laughs> Me, no, no, my pockets are not fucking full. Too bad I don't have one of these already. I'd be okay with five grand. So the bard, yeah, the bard knife draws are worth five thousand. The rest of them are worth three. Yes, 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 yes. Bard knife draw. I'm gonna sell these guys and then go do some uh, some errands for people. I don't know, what do you guys think? Should I fish it up or should I should I go irritate my, my neighbors? <laughs> I wish I had a pitfall. You just push one into a hole and leave them there. <laughs> that would be hilarious. Alright, well. Regular? Ooh, I don't have that one. Gotta donate. Gonna have the best museum ever. Enjoy it. My milk pouring. Whoop. Yay. Yeah, man. Totes spoiled. I'm actually gonna die. Ooh. Another fish. Yeah, I thought you'd appreciate it. You can actually make cottage cheese with milk and it's like white vinegar or something like that it's weird it like causes it to uh lump up and stuff it's very strange <gasps> a lake fish okay well, lake fish is not interested notice me <laughs> Cottage cheese milk is the best. I don't, I don't know about that. I, I feel like that's wrong. Um, I'm not sure why. What's up, Rhoda? You said? See it. I never played Amoeba Festival. That one and then Happy Home Designer I never played. Good lord money. <laughs> it looks bad, but I'll play. <laughs> there you go, that's the spirit. Yeah, I, like, those two games, I just kind of acknowledge as being Animal Crossing, but I don't classify them as, like, real Animal Crossing games. It's a fish! Ooh, catfish. I think I'll name it Whiskers. 
Why? <laughs> I don't get it. What? Oh yeah, that the the one where you play as the mayor is New Leaf. I absolutely love that game. Like it make I I actually was considering downloading an emulator for the 3DS just to see if I could play that in, as opposed to this cuz like New Leaf has you know like all the best features from all the previous games. Like I that is an excellent game. Hands down. Like no question. Cause like you can you can build things like outside, like around your town. You can create like public works projects. Um, it's really cool because like you're that you have to wait until they're suggested by like your neighbors and stuff. And like what each person is able to suggest depends on their personality. <laughs> For some pizza. But yeah, if they had something on the Switch, that'd be awesome. Even if they just ported New Leaf to the Switch, that'd be great. I wish they had it so that the, um, you could plug in your 3DS games into the Switch and play them on your TV. I feel like that would be sick. Because the Switch uses cartridges. So that'd be really cool. Though it'd probably cost like extra hardware and whatnot. That's the only downside. I'd fucking pay for it. Let's be honest. Okay, well... Sweet, they're both down here. <laughs> be, just be happy. Yeah, that's soon, isn't it? I'm gonna write Hambo a letter. Or will I? 16th of June. That's pretty close. A couple weeks from now. Or three weeks from now. Something like that. Hey, guy. Girl. Thing. God, Nibbles, you never... Nibbles never has anything for me to do. Nibbles secretly hates me. Which she probably should, considering the first day she moved in, I beat her up with a net and pushed her around. So there's that. <laughs> it's not my fault. <laughs> She's asking for it. Yeah. Oh. Well, uh, are you the type of person that would enjoy watching? some of the games and that sort of thing. Because I could just emulate some of the stuff that you haven't seen. Because it may be stuff that I haven't played either. Be an experience for everybody. All right, little fish. Come on, dude. Come on, dude. Burrow. Oh, oh. Sweet. Mm. Yeah, what what are some of the uh, some of the games that you missed out on? Look at my gold tree; it's pretty, it's so pretty. <laughs> All right, um, oh, donating stuff. Ba, 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 ba. 
かった。My net. I need that. I definitely need to finish up Paper Mario so I can move on to other things like that. Did you see um, Twilight Princess? Did you play that? Uh, Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess? That was actually that was on both the GameCube and the Wii. Because they took so long to release it. This is pretty much the exact same thing that happened with Breath of the Wild, but like two generations ago. <laughs> Or, geez, three generations ago. Good lord. No? No, it was two. Yeah, it was two. Paper Mario Fire Emblem. I have Fire Emblem Path of Radiance on my computer. Um, I actually played part of the way through it, and I was really enjoying it. So I could just restart it, honestly, if you wanted to see it. Um, I really want to play Xenoblade. Because uh, I played... Xenoblade Chronicles X, I think, and that was for the Wii U, and I thought that game was fucking sick. Um, it's, it's like, it's a really strange fighting um, mechanic. Like, I've never played a game like it. No, there's nothing else in there. I don't think there is. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I... I honestly didn't know about Xenoblade until Shulk came out on the fourth Super Smash Brothers. I was like, who the fuck is this person? <laughs> but yeah, they're actually making a Xeno another Xenoblade for the Switch. Um, that was one of the games that they were teasing some sometime recently. Um, I think it was when they revealed the Switch was when they showed it off. But yeah, the music, even it, like even in Xenoblade Chronicles X, um, the music is really good. Like I love, like the, you can get like a uh, basically a mech, and it's called a skell, like a skeleton, and you can fly around in the skell. And the music that comes on while you're flying is so good. Like I would fly around and burn fuel just so I could fucking listen to this song. No, Mr. Fish! But yeah, dude, like, it was... I love that game. It was so good. And Xeno... It's like... Xenoblade is such an, like, underground type of title, too. But yeah, um... Animal Crossing OST... I'm not sure I know what you're talking about. Alright, Mr. Fish. Good lord. Oh my god, I'm dying. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, I like- I think I like the original Animal Crossing soundtrack the best. It's so chill. Well, okay. No fish for me. But I'm sucking it up, as far as fish are concerned. Maybe the game's just being nice to me because it knows I suck at fishing. I'll take it. <laughs> oh, hello, little fish. Mm -hmm. 
I honestly think the reason it was unheard of is like they didn't know advertising for it at all. And like the big retailers that normally like people go to to find stuff like that. I don't even know if they had it out just because it wasn't as well known. Well, I messed up. I goofed. But yeah, I was... When I saw... I saw the release trailer, whatever, teaser for Xenoblade Chronicles 2. And it was before they'd even, like, given it a name. <laughs> I think they literally just called it X at that point. But it was, I was so excited for that game. Like, it just looked amazing. Especially considering that you could play with people online. That just, like, blew my mind. Granted, I, like, haven't at all. I, I don't, I'm not sure why, to be honest. Uh, I never really took advantage of the online stuff. Well, you can own some, but... Yeah, the, I, the online stuff would be really cool. I, I... I couldn't see them not bringing it back. At least, like, I, it may be different, but if they just, like, cut out online gameplay, I'd be very surprised. Because um, that's usually such a big thing, especially with um, RPGs. Like, being able to play with your friends is such a huge motivation to actually get a game. Especially for people that are like older, like us at this point. Like, so many, like I know so many of my friends will like, they either will or won't buy a game. Oh, uh, yeah, I got you. But yeah, like I, I've got friends that, you know, they either will or won't buy a game based on how many of their friends are getting it. Yeah, because it's like, if you think a game looks awesome, <laughs> except for Bali, and and this other guy, and uh, and this oh oh oh, and this this other guy, and my friend, <laughs> I'm just doing this shit. Um, but yeah, like I had a friend of mine where he thought this one game, uh, it was For Honor, right before it came out, and For Honor apparently like fell off really fast, but. Um, he was really, he thought the game looked awesome and but he was just like you know I don't I don't think I'm gonna get it just because he didn't think anyone else was gonna get it What's up? hated what for honor I honestly didn't look into it at all I was I, I had no interest at all Cause like, I, I've played MMO, I mean granted it'd be like a new thing. Oh god, yeah, I honestly have been leaning away from Ubisoft. Like, I don't, I don't remember what it was that kind of like set me off. To being like, uh, fuck Ubisoft. Yeah, I don't, I don't remember what it was. I got the choice to either get For Honor or... Oh... Uh... Yeah, I remember you told me it was just as bad. <laughs> it's funny. It's funny for me, I guess. It was at least it was free. Kind of. I mean, you got the thing that you're gonna buy anyways, and it came along with it, so at least you didn't spend money on it. Yeah, like Ubisoft just—they were spitting out so much shit so quickly. That's not even like a graphic intensive game. Yeah, like honestly, their games are always buggy as shit. Like I, I really enjoyed um, some of the Assassin's Creeds, if if only for the story, because like la especially later on, like at when this Assassin's Creed Three happened, and then since then, I think 
I haven't played since then, so I can't really say. Um, but the gameplay just got it. It went from being like extremely delicate and precise in Assassin's Creed 2 to press a button to parry and kill someone immediately, and it was just like, what the fuck? <laughs> But yeah, I definitely at least want to play the arc with uh, Ezio, just because, you know, my mom used to teach, or my mom used to teach Latin, and um, so I know a lot about, like, Roman history, or ancient Roman history and that sort of thing. Brotherhood is a pretty fun party game, really. Assassin's Creed doesn't strike me as a, a party game <laughs> by any stretch of the imagination. I can't tell if you're fucking with me or if you're completely honest. Yeah, no, I I definitely like uh, learning about history. I'm not like a history buff, where it's like, oh yeah, I need to know every fucking thing about everything, blah blah blah, but it's just like, I think it's really interesting to see like how people lived and that sort of thing. It's just cool, like, how things have changed, how things have stayed the same. Oh, well, yeah, true. It's it's not the same time period, but there's still, like, the architecture is left over um, that originated in ancient Rome that you can still see in that sort of thing um, during the gameplay. Sorry. Yeah, you're absolutely right. Oh, and uh, welcome to the stream, Everlast. <laughs> you hide in the background over there. I see you. <laughs> But yeah, I really like um, the Roman architecture and the, just that sort of thing. <laughs> What's up, dude? But it's um, it was really cool. That was one thing I liked about the first one with Ezio, the first second one. <laughs> um, but I wish it was in ancient, or it was in Rome. And I think that's like part two, if I'm not mistaken. So I definitely want to get that sometime, just so I can like look at the buildings and whatnot. Because they did an amazing job with the architecture and modeling and stuff for the buildings and like those games. I got gotcha. you. Yeah, it's kind of sad that that was the case, especially because, like, they came out with, um, like, I really enjoyed Watch Dogs. I haven't played the second one, um, at all, like, I don't know anything about it, but, you know, they had some things where, um, they had implemented certain things in Watch Dogs better than they did in fucking GTA, and GTA's been doing that type of game for years. Blood Dragon. Was that one of the, um... Like, Dragon Age games? They- cause Dragon Age was done by Ubisoft, wasn't it? Or is that EA? No, I think it's EA. Wow, I really didn't collect a whole lot. <laughs> oh, Far Cry. Okay, sorry. Yeah, I'm not familiar with most of Ubisoft's stuff, to be honest. Oh, uh, I got you. Some DLC type of stuff, I'm assuming. Oh, wow. Okay. That's interesting. Yeah, that definitely sounds like something they would do as DLC rather than a standalone. That's kind of cool, though. Yeah. 
So nothing, nothing big, but it was still quality, I'm guessing. See, that's the thing. Like, I don't understand. Oh. Uh, yeah, like, I don't, I don't understand, like, why companies just don't pay attention to, like, reviews and stuff. Because... Cyborg Sharks! <laughs> um, but yeah, the, there's so much information all over the place about people talking about, you know, like, what they're excited for and that sort of thing. And if they... If developers just ask people, it's like, you know, what would you guys like to see in a game? Or it's like, what, or not even that, it's like, what did you like from our previous games? Because they could just build, like, build off of that, those mechanics. Because usually it's like the original game that, um, that catches people. Like, it's not often that it's a late game that brings people in. It's usually like one of the originals. And so it's just like, or at least like one of the more recent, and the, you just pay attention to your sales numbers. It's it's not rocket science. Like, let's be honest. Like people just need to do their fucking jobs as far as like HR and that sort of thing. Well, but that's the thing is like, even if they turned more towards art, they would still make money. Cause it's fucking like, if you make quality shit, you're going to make money. Yeah, but that's it, it like, because it, pretty much anything that involves industry is pretty much, or ideally should be a blend between art and industry, where it's like a blend of like the good and the bad. Yeah, I can definitely see it being the consumer's fault, because, like, a lot of people will just buy anything where it's like, oh, it's, it's, you know, within this franchise, I need to buy it, where it's just like, I'm not like that at all. Like, I feel like, well, there are certain things that I'll be like that for, but, well, no, I, I can't, I can't even say, because, like, the one thing that I was thinking of was Metroid. But they came out with Metroid Federation, Metro Prime Federation Porsche, and I was not interested at all, and didn't buy it, didn't play it, didn't acknowledge it really. Yeah, they they really do defend it really hard, because it's like if you know if if you don't like our product, then you can go somewhere else, and it's like. When did you when did your ego get so inflated where it's like you think it's okay to bash the people that support you basically? Yeah, dude, the indie scene is great. Like, I'm really glad Nintendo. Like you said, I, one of our conversations a while back, where you're saying that you were you thought it was cool that um, Nintendo was kind of jumping into the indie scene. I think that's fucking awesome. Because, like, so many good games are in the indie scene and just need to be played so that you can get the reviews and stuff off. Oh, oh. Alright, Mr. Fish. You and I, we're gonna duke it out. Yeah! No, it's a boot! <laughs> I think I know what you're saying. But uh, I want to give a shout out to the uh, the lurkers out there that are watching from afar. Glad to have you here. Hope you enjoy. And obviously, uh, glad to have uh, the rest of you in here as well. Sophomore, Polly, Everlast, and uh, I believe Kayla's still in here. Yep, okay, let's look. <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, no, I, I agree. Um, and that's the thing, is like, they... If your company is going to succeed, it has to kind of take, a, take into account all of the um, people that are going to play your game. And that's, that's one thing, like, I absolutely love the Metroid Prime series. Because, like, the Metroid Prime series had, you know, it was everything that you could enjoy about a game, really. Where it was like, you know, like, you had your, your action adventure, you had your detail and lore, if you wanted to, you didn't even have to do that. And they just made it available for, like, if you want to, um... If you want a deep, more depth to your story and that sort of thing, then it's available. And it had, like, unlockables and customization and stuff. Granted, the, the customization was, like, you pick it up your wear for the whole rest of the game, but... Um... I, I just like that it was flexible in how you could play it. I've actually, <laughs> it's funny that you say that, I've actually streamed all three of them. Um, yeah, Metroid Prime. I've actually streamed all three Metroid Primes since I, um, yeah. But, considering I played the first two, I, I love the Metroid Prime series, dude. Like, <laughs> yeah. Um, oh, that's right, yeah, he hopped in on the third one. Uh, I started with the second one, went to the first, and went to the third. You know, now that I think about that, that was actually how I played through them the first time. That's kind of cool. <laughs> I didn't even realize that. Um, but yeah, like, I honestly would be totally fine replaying those games, especially since I have the edition on Metroid Prime Trilogy. Because uh, the ones I played for the first two were their standalone for the GameCube, or the emulated versions of the standalone. But, um... I also have their versions on Metroid Prime Trilogy now, so I could play them. I I love those games. Um, you know, honestly, like, a lot of people shit all over L Other M, apparently. I I don't know why. Like, I, I, I wanted to take it for what it was, and when I, when I did that, like, I just went into it with an open mind, and I, I you know, I really enjoyed it. it was, Other M was a very, very interesting game, like, it was a mesh between, um, yeah, Everla yeah, Everlast was the one who actually suggested me play Metroid Prime 3. Uh, I forgot about that, yeah, thank you. <laughs> it was I love that game, dude. Um. And it was, it was a lot better than I remembered playing through, I remember, like, the whole series is so good. I just sold everything. But yeah, I, I honestly like when I get suggestions like that. You know, like, sometimes I'll ask, but, um, and I, I actually asked when you suggested it to me. Um, but sometimes I don't get feedback, and I feel like... It's hunters. Yeah, I definitely need to get my. Oh, Metroid Prime Hunters was great. Yeah, I I've heard good things about it. I honestly never played it, never never touched it. Um, but yeah, I definitely will play through some of the like. What? I don't listen. <laughs> yeah, whatever, Kayla. Um. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm trying to stick with Nintendo. <laughs> Cheese and rice. <laughs> what I just caught. Hmm. 
I kind of want to play Metroid Fusion again. It's been a while since I played that. <laughs> I don't know about all that. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, I made I made two cents today from uh, YouTube. Two cents, guys. <laughs> it was actually pretty cool. <laughs> it took me three months. Three months to make two cents. <laughs> uh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, you are you talking about the ad blocker thing? You disabled that. I honestly don't have ad blockers on my computers anymore just because, like, I kind of... It's kind of been eye-opening how much that influences how much money you make. I got you. Oh, uh, okay. Well, but that's the thing, is like, um... The way Nintendo does it is different. They handle all your money stuff, and then you provide a PayPal account. And then they just dump money in your PayPal account based on how much money your channel accumulates off of ad revenue. So I actually don't use AdSense at all. I remember starting one, but that was before um, before I'd signed up with the Creators Program. Yeah, it it was. They dumped two cents. <laughs> A whole two cents. Yeah, I I signed up for it and whatnot just because like I thought that's what I would have to do for the monetization. It seemed kind of obnoxious, so I'm glad like I have my Nintendo stuff. I do need to like talk to somebody about some of my videos because some of them aren't even monetized and I don't know why. Even though like all of my stuff on there is uh, Nintendo based. Especially, because like right now, for some reason, there's one guy who likes watching, I have like a 100% playthrough of Pokemon Coliseum, and there's one guy that just like has been rolling through like hours of that shit <laughs> on his Xbox, and I need to make sure those are monetized <laughs> so I can get money off that guy. The guy's gonna pay my bills with my two cents every three months. <laughs> But yeah, it's kind of cool, like, uh, YouTube has, like, so many different things where you can look at, like, where they're from, like, what operating system, like, what, even what console, basically, like, like, if they're on a console or not. And it's just like, good lord, like, this is so much information. <laughs> and it's kind of, it's kind of eye-opening where it's like, when you accept the terms to, like, watch things, um, like, what you're signing up for. Yeah, I like looking at the analytics. Like, oh, god damn it, Yuka. She wants a cherry, and I have no cherries. <coughs> That's funny. Yeah, like, I had some guy in a... It was probably not some guy, it was probably Orpoi. She was a, a follower I had for a bit. I haven't seen him in a while. But he, he was in Brazil, and I was getting a decent amount of Brazilian views. Uh, I got some from Portugal, too. That kind of blew my mind. And then some... I got a handful from Japan and whatnot, but I think they stopped watching it as soon as they realized I was speaking English. <laughs> but, it, yeah, it's really cool seeing, like, the uh, demographics for all the different people watching. God, what's with all this? See, this, this, this is why I pick up trash when I walk around. I don't pick up all the trash, because eventually I kind of hit my limit. I'm like, fuck it, that's not my problem. But I do pick up stuff sometimes, because it's just irritating. It's like, we're, we're adults, and we can't pick up after ourselves. <laughs> Poor Polly. <laughs> you just gotta give it to him. <laughs> 
Yeah, what do you- how do you, uh, go about resolving that there, Polly? They, uh, bash you for your- your credit card info. Oh, I forgot. Oh, no! They don't have a slingshot in this game. You have to wait for it to land on a tree. I totally forgot about that. Wow, look at all the sea bass. Mr. Balloon! Please land in a tree. Pretty, pretty please. How about this one? Land in this one. <gasps> okay, well, this one? Oh, no. Thank you. <laughs> All right. <laughs> That's funny. Ooh, a violin. <laughs> the Dreamcast one. Seems so random. Kayla! What are you doing? You're so quiet. Oh yeah. Guys, 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 guys. Look, I'm fancy. Hell yeah, dude! I got a violin. <gasps> Let's get rid of these fish. I don't want a mosquito. I'll pass. GTA 6? What the hell? Do people are ridiculous, I swear. don't remember how to get the gold axe in this game. Wow. That's incredible. Hey man, that, I mean that's one way to do it. That That is a strategy is to just trick people to believe in you. It's not, it's not cool. I mean, it's not respectable, but it's one way to do it. God, Boris, you are useless. Yeah. Yeah, this is the thing. Like, that's... The one thing that makes me sad about the internet is just, like, providing content that's just belligerently false. <laughs> yeah, for real, though. Disclaimer, don't click that fucking link. <laughs> One second, my wife's going into labor. Like, just, <laughs> just fuck with them. Yeah, no, I, I, I figured that much for myself. It's the way you do it, man. Oh, one second. <laughs> 
It reminds me like uh I used to fuck with my friends where um they you know they like would be looking for something like and like I'd be at my friend's house or whatever and he'd be in his basement and I'd be like sitting down doing whatever and he'd be looking for something and um He'd be like, yo, have you seen my, you know, whatever the fuck it was? And I'd be like, yeah, it's over there. And I just wouldn't point or anything. And, um... He'd be like, where? And I'd be like, it's right there, dude. <laughs> just not, not fucking point, not help, not <laughs> do anything. Most of the time, I wouldn't even know. <laughs> I wouldn't even, like, I would just be up with him the whole time. <laughs> That's great. Nope, it's the fish. Yeah, dude, everybody needs the ad revenue. <laughs> dude, I wonder how much money he made just off of that, like, scam bullshit. Like, do you think YouTube will step in and be like, no, you're full of shit with stuff like that? Because ultimately, you are making YouTube money. What's all over CSGO? Uh... What's done? Jesus. Yeah, I mean, that's not uncommon, honestly. Like, especially if you look at, like, old RPGs, like MMOs. I got you. Um, like old RPGs, they'll have, they'll make new characters sit in like the main lobbies of, um, like towns and stuff. And they'll just have a bot, and they'll just run like their spam thing. It's really obnoxious, honestly, because it's like, I'm just trying to play this game. I don't want you ruining my fucking fun. But, people do it. Ooh, money! <laughs> I want to stick a bard knife on my house. I used to yell at the bot. <laughs> uh, I don't. I can't. I can't remember ever having done that. Well, I scared the fish. Thanks, mosquito. Thanks, Obama. time I swear it's trash I'll tell you you voted for me uh, I didn't vote for either one of them <laughs> I would have voted for Obama I just I had to go to class couldn't wait in line all day long I would not have voted for Trump actually I would have slight I would have voted my desire to vote for Trump would only have been slightly less. Well, whatever. I just, I'm going to say this one thing. My, my desire to vote for Trump was only, like, slightly less than my desire to vote for Hillary. That's not saying that they both were, like, equally represented. They both were just pieces of shit. And thus, we have the American political system. All right, that's it. That's it. Right there. We're done. We're done. <laughs> Yeah, I know, I know. <laughs> oh, I got you. No, I was just bitching. <laughs> That's all I was doing. Uh, but hey, man, at least I can be the mayor in uh, New Leaf. Animal Crossing. I run the show in that game. I should look to see if they do have a, um, what do you call it, emulator for 3DS. Yeah, but I mean, considering my, uh, from my perspective, 
from what I've seen as far as like media outlets and that sort of thing, I think I am on side of majority, but at the same time, like I don't want my No I wanna do I wanna play New Leaf. <laughs> um I don't want my channel to be political. Politics are no fun. Come on, fish. Yeah. No, no, I got you. Words of wisdom, to be honest. Honestly, it's better to just keep your mouth shut sometimes. I like fishing in this game. That's what I do. Plus, I get a lot of money. <laughs> yeah, that's very true. People tend to be very fickle. Look up Citra? I don't think I saw what happened to JonTron. I don't really watch stuff like that. Citra. Citra. Am I looking at pictures or... Ooh. Internet cable playing. Huh. Dude, that'd be fucking sick, man. Oh, wow. Oh, that's right. I heard someone got removed from ukulele, but I didn't know what it was. Yeah, honestly, if I could get... You stream from your device, your PC with it. Oh, what are you what are you talking about? I'm not sure what you're talking about. But yeah, as far as like why I'm fishing, um, I don't know. I like fishing in this game. If you want me to not fish, I can do other things. Um, it's relaxing, and you can. Oh. Um, uh, what about it? I mean, I just looked at it. It's an emulator. Yeah. It's, it seems to be a 3DS emulator. No, you're good. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what comments? No. <laughs> um, but yeah, you can... Fishing is basically like the way you make money the easiest in this game. It's like, it's consistent money. There are other ways, like playing with the turnip market and stuff, but I like fishing just because, like, it's relaxing. It's nice. Come on, Mr. Fish. Mr. Fish. Mr. Fish. God, fuck you, dude. So relaxing. <laughs> Let me tell you. Oh, bye, fish. Is it going to fall off? Yep, he fell off. <laughs> Sploosh. Wow, I'm used- to, I don't think I've seen it do that. Uh, uh. <laughs> what the hell? That was weird. Usually it just falls off the waterfall. That was very strange. Forest, do you actually have something to do that? Oh, sweet. No! No, 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 no. Oh my god, he's actually mad. Oh, uh, I was about to say. Yeah, I was like, I don't know how to walk on the waterfall. <laughs> I just pissed off my neighbor on accident. I didn't mean it.
I did download Green Day Rock Band though. I pretty much booted it up to confirm that it worked and then that was it. I also bought new pads. I think you were there when I was talking about it. I, I bought and replaced all the new pads or all the pads on my drum set so everything's way more sensitive now. All right, buddy, can you calm down? Please? Can I, like, pour water on your head or something? Get you to simmer down? I missed a fish. How much money do I owe now? I can probably finish paying off this part of my house today. Uh, I'm not sure. The only downside with that is I'd need a double pedal. Um, I don't have a second pedal. Yeah, I actually, I've never played with a double bass. Still a 19 grand. That's not bad. That's four barred knife jaws. Or seven red snappers. <laughs> you know. Common units of money. <laughs> Alright, Kiki, you got anything for me to do? Kitty cat. Oh. <laughs> gotcha. Bob. Get that Game Boy. As if my life depended on it. We're gonna shake some cheese along the way. Everybody needs a good tree shaking. Shake, shake, shake. Alright, we're gonna do this. Son of a bitch! <laughs> it was exactly the same but I'm pretty sure they actually came out with an N64 game I don't know oh master of the bees he's laughing at me because my face is fucked up maybe I should just piss him off again you need to talk to Mr. Bob and Mr. Hambo Alright, Mr. Bob. Stop looking at the fish. <laughs> You're looking swell, as in swollen. <laughs> Damn it. I like how they look at the fish. I look at the fish. This is bullshit. Oh, 
Happy six year old. That's funny. <laughs> That's pretty funny. I had for the N64 were Pokemon Stadium, Pokemon Stadium 2, and Pokemon Snap. <laughs> Needless to say, I liked Pokemon. <laughs> Still do. Wow. She just called me a monster. It's not very nice. We're going to cry. I didn't own Ocarina of Time until I guess the Wii came out. And then I bought it on the Virtual Console. Same thing with Majora's Mask. Dude, I loved Majora's Mask. Like, that's such a damn good game. Alright, Boris, 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 Boris. Oh, I got you. Yeah, I'd, I never really had access to PlayStation at all. Like, my mom... Um, my mom bought me Nintendo stuff, and then I just saved up money for more Nintendo stuff, so. Stationary? Woo! Ranch paper and ranch table. PlayStation? Yeah, I got you. That's the thing, is like, I feel like PlayStation and Nintendo have way better, like, IP than fucking Xbox does. And the Xbox has, like, such an ego. Like, everyone who plays Xbox is like, yeah, man, Xbox is the shit, blah, blah, blah. And it's like, you can literally play almost every single thing on an Xbox on a computer. Like, there's nothing special about a fucking Xbox. Pretty much the only, like, they have Forza, some of Halo, and, like, Halo 5, you can play on fucking computer right now. And so it's just like, why would I even want to buy a fucking Xbox? Yeah, and, like, even those series, you can now play on the computer. So it's like, what does the Xbox have going for it? Yeah, but even Forza is just a fucking racing game. Like, there's nothing special about it. Oh, yeah. I wanted to want to check out my new table, guys. I think the branch table is a glass top. 
I guess I'm just doing a ranch, um, a ranch house type of thing. That's what it's turning into. I'm running out of space. Oh god, that's way too big. It's so big! Shit, what do I do? <laughs> Well, you can play you can play Halo One and Halo Two, but you can play yeah you can play Halo Five as long as you um you have the anniversary update yeah the it's a bit like for me it's been a bitch getting the anniversary update to work because like I've I've got friends who got it and that sort of thing I don't I don't want the ranch table honestly I don't like it. I got gotcha. you. That's usually how it goes. Bam, bam. Nothing to sell. The only reason you're open is so you can buy shit from me. <laughs> that's it. That, that's it. Oh. Uh, no, I get no, I was definitely thinking of Halo 5, but I didn't realize it was only the Forge. But still, even in the Forge, you can still play all the different maps and stuff. There's just no campaign. It's, it's like a dumbed-down version of the online stuff on the Xbox. But still, like... Wow, what's with the cockroaches? <laughs> you and mankind divided, I swear. So salty. <laughs> oh, that's right. You pl Everlast, you play Halo, don't you? I forgot about that. Yeah, Sophomoric uh, doesn't- is definitely not a fan of 4 and 5. I- I was never really a Halo person, but I have a friend of mine who, like, really fucking good at it. But people- yeah, no, I got you. That's the thing, is like, online games that are competitive will get you viewers, like, no doubt. <laughs> yeah, Sophomore, you need to, you know, calm your titties over there. <laughs> it, it, it's okay. <laughs> So did you grow up, or, uh... oh, never mind. I miss I misread something. So Everlast, did you grow up with Xbox? You know, like after we <laughs> just bashed, bashed the shit out of it. <laughs> like I definitely understand, like, cause my friends, the reason why they still play it is um, primarily because like all their friends have played it, and that's what they played for so long. 
it's pretty much along the lines of like, um, you know, this is how it's always been done sort of thing, which means it's fine. Um, Cause I mean, I, I, yeah, you know, I can't really say much, especially for video games, or, or where video games are concerned, because like I've been playing Nintendo my whole life, and definitely going to continue to do that. But oh, really? That's cool. <laughs> Sophomore. <laughs> Yeah, they really are like Call of Duty. Even Call of Duty is not even like Call of Duty anymore. So it's like there, it it's like uh, the current Call of Duty is pretty much uh, parkour and guns, and then the new Halos are space parkour and guns. <laughs> That's, that's one thing I've been wanting Nintendo to do, honestly, and that's one thing that makes me really happy about, like, Xenoblade, is they're still able to come out with new franchises that still interest me. You know. Yeah, dude, like... New, new IPs, because, like, especially Nintendo... Well, everyone does it, let's be honest. Everyone's just like, okay, well, you know, we have this game, and here's the new version of this game, sort of thing. And that's... that That's what everyone does. That, uh, that's it. Um, I mean, granted, you know, there are... Some do it better than others... Oh, wow. But yeah, I honestly think Nintendo is stepping up their game. Um, one of the things that Nintendo struggled with for the longest time was... Um, what do you call it? Um, not, like, being too conservative with how they treated the market and their content. But now that they've kind of loosened the chains a little bit, it's... It allows people to be more creative with their content while also allowing them to make money off of it. And they're also just presenting it in a way that's more relatable to people. Like they actually understand a little bit more of what's going on than they used to. Which is definitely a good thing. Because for a long time, and they still, they still run into this problem, but for a long time, it just seemed like they didn't have a fucking clue as to like what was going on. And that's still true when they release anything that's like a limited edition. Like I love Nintendo, but they are awful at distribution for limited edition um, items of any variety. Like the Amiibo, they... God, I like I was never a big thing big fan of the amiibo just because it, it cost so much money. Yeah, arms arms looks kinda interesting. I'm um and yeah, Splatoon, oh good lord. That did so well on the Wii U. Also Mario Maker. Mario Maker fucking blew up when it released. Um But yeah, like when the amiibo came out, um they they just understocked that that was it that's all they do they understock fucking everything and they make it so that you can pre-order stuff like that which is a no-no big no-no because scalpers are just like i'm gonna pre-order every fucking one of them and then you see them on like they're sold out immediately and then um then you see them on ebay for like two or three times their original, like, um, retail value, and it's just like, Nintendo, why do you do this? Like, they learned a little bit, and they learn occasionally, but, like, like, for my 3DS, it was, it's the limited edition, like, gold-plated, um, new Nintendo 3DS XL, 
with uh, Majora's Mask. It has the different masks on it. And they released it twice. Yukaza? I don't know what that means. Um, but they released it twice, because the first time they released it, within 45 minutes, every single one everywhere was sold out through pre-orders. And it was just like, okay. <laughs> Oh, uh, wow. That's fucking stupid, dude. I hate when people extort shit like that. Like, okay, a good example, Metroid Prime Trilogy was a limited edition release. And, you know, I got it just because, you know, Metroid Prime is, like, my fucking, like, that's my baby. <laughs> but, um, you know, if you, if you find it, in stores used it's like $25 more than it was when it first came out and it's just like okay <laughs> it's ridiculous like literally like I remember seeing it for like $75 for Metro Prime Trilogy and I was just like good lord so ridiculous really Dude, I hate that. Like, that's one thing I hate. I mean, it makes sense, especially when you go back that far. But, like, Metroid Prime Trilogy was a Wii game. You know, like, that's that's recent. Like, when you talk about, like, Dreamcast and that sort of thing, that makes sense because they're antiques. Or at least in my opinion. Like, things like that should uh, gain uh, value over time. Oh, yeah, no doubt it's the popular games. Like, Super Mario Sunshine, you'd have to pay, like, 60 or $70 for it um, if you were going to get it used, like, a few years after it came out. Because it was hard to find. That's one thing I really like about the virtual console that Nintendo has going on. I absolutely love the virtual console. I'm honestly probably gonna buy a, um, like an external hard drive, probably like a terabyte, and just attach it to, um, your, oh, your Super Mario Sunshine is gone. That sucks. I'm probably just gonna attach it to my Switch whenever I end up getting one. So I can just download whatever. I don't have to actually go out and buy it. Because the other, the other nice thing about being able to download stuff, aside from the fact that you don't have to go anywhere, is they have the uh, My Nintendo program, which replaced um, Club Nintendo. Because Club Nintendo, it used to be like you get the codes in your game and you redeem the code and then you can get like prizes and shit. Well, nowadays they have My Nintendo and you can link it up with like different things. Um, you can link it up to like your 3DS and your um, your your Wii U. I would assume your Switch as well. I just don't have a Switch, so I don't know. Um, but yeah, exactly. You can actually get coins for buying their um, their digital download software. And it's really cool because you use those coins as like discounts for other games that they have going on. And they'll have like temporary sales and stuff. And it's really cool. Um, the thing about registering stuff, like nowadays you couldn't get anything. Um, but I know like I have, I have three posters in my living room right now where it's from the uh, the brand new Super Smash. It was like right before uh, Club Nintendo ended, but I actually got, uh, it was three Super Smash pro posters. They're really cool, they're really well done, because I mean, it's, it's fucking Nintendo, they're not gonna release crap. Um, but yeah, you just get them for free if you register enough stuff. The only downside is you have to register enough stuff within like a certain time frame. And then you have to, like, ask for stuff based on, um, what they have available at the time for an unreleased game. What is it? I didn't realize they were still making games for the Wii U. 
I know they s just, I think they just stopped production of Wii games. Um. Oh wow, that's cool. Mr. Fish, that's right. Oh, yeah, that's cool. Hmm. It's always, like, I, that sort of stuff doesn't really happen to me, because I don't really know people, but, um, it's always cool hearing about that sort of thing. Catfish. Hmm. As far as you're going. What do you mean, as far as you're going? Uh, okay. <laughs> good talk, good talk. <laughs> That's funny. for that sort of thing. The more you know. That sucks. That's the way it goes, I guess. See my yellow tree? Isn't it beautiful? <laughs> hey, Rhoda. Wow, you suck. At least I can fish all the time. Hey, Pate. Please, or something. Pretty please? Oh my god. Forest. Forest. 
dude. I like. <laughs> I first stepped out of Lego. That's the day you become a man. <laughs> You've never experienced pain until that day. <laughs> hey, Yuka. Excuse me. <laughs> I think they would make the bridge wide enough for uh, two people. Boris. Boris, come back. Rhoda! Rhoda! You know what I want to do? Um, this game, it just kind of shows up randomly. I think... It's city folk that you're thinking of. That was that was also one thing that's really cool about New Leaf is you can actually like destroy and rebuild b bridges. So like let's say you you built a bridge early in the game and then you eventually are able to unlock like one with a different aesthetic. Um, you can actually destroy the one that you had built. And then you have to wait a day for it to be destroyed. Um, and then right after that, you can pay to have a different bridge put into place. Right where it was. Nibbles! But yeah, like the amount of customization in New Leaf is awesome. Like, it, it is the best. <laughs> That's so cool. Like, if I could get New Leaf working, I'd probably just end up playing that, honestly. Like, I, it's so good. Especially, like, they just came out with a new update, too, with the Amiibo stuff. Um, you can actually put, like, Zelda characters. Since, you know, they had all of the Animal Crossing Amiibo. Oh. I gotcha. I don't- I don't think I'm honestly gonna play, um, City Folk ever. It just, like, that was probably my least favorite of the bunch. I don't know what it was about it, but, like, it just- It was just kind of, like, there was nothing special about it. Um, I don't know. Like, I remember Wild World's, like, claim to fame was it had the- the internet. That was what was special about it, and it had so many more, like, um, so many more neighbor options, and, like, even, like, um, what do you call it, um, different types of animals, as well as, like, different people. I think that was the first game they had an octopus, honestly. Maybe not, I don't remember. Um, but yeah, like, they have some pretty cool characters. Sweet! I can pay off my house! I can pay off my house! Woo! <laughs> Probably just broke my fucking microphone. <laughs> I tend to do that sometimes. <laughs> That's the way it goes, I guess. Off the home. Deposit. All the monies. All of them. Oh. Hell yeah. I love how Pelly just doesn't even acknowledge my face when you're super fucked. finish his little theme song. <laughs> Clap for me, Yuka. Oh, okay. Never mind. I was just kidding. Uh, hello? There's water right in front of me. What is happening? Okay. 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 Come on. Come on. Come on, Mr. Fish. Yeah. 
God. If I look like you, I would never step foot outside my house again. <laughs> uh, thanks? <laughs> I guess? <laughs> but yeah, city folk, I don't know. There was nothing really... Like, the only thing that really stands out to me, as far as like my memory, was like the fact that you could get that fountain in your town. And you could like throw your axe in it and stuff. <laughs> And very good wings. All right, guys. So I have a question. Would you guys want to see me play? Well, I guess there are three options. I can continue playing this and like get my try and get my stuff hooked up so I can go to the island. Um, continue Paper Mario since I still need to follow do that or play Metroid Fusion. Three options. You guys, let me know. grass people I wonder if she has a snow shirt that'd be cool more snow shirt oh come on Pate yeah you never have anything for me to do and all you do is piss off Hambo it's not cool He had a rough day. He deserves a letter.
Steams my broccoli. Oh, wow, she's right here. <laughs> she's right here. Hmm. Run along now, you peasant. Yuka seems like she'd be a part of an aristocracy. What's going on? Your camera is going on. Nooblet! <laughs> remembered what was so special about um, City Folk. City Folk was the one where they had the microphone communication and I hated it. <laughs> then that was about it. The more you know. Dude, I should probably feed my character. Nom 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 nom. Yeah, dude. It did hate me. That's why I hated it. It was just not very nice. What am I doing? Oh, yeah, I want to talk to Hambo. Hambo. Hambro! I should have called him Hambro. cherry and if I got a cherry I sure as hell would not give it to you squirt stone tile Let's check this out see how this looks in comparison to my current uh yeah no this at least looks nice, even if it is covered in shit. <laughs> Whatever. I'm gonna be nice and keep my letters.
You know, when you think about it, it's pretty impressive that he can shake this tree all on his own. Trees don't, aren't exactly that easy to shake. I guess they're not very big. Still. Muscular little dude. Yeah. My face just exploded. Oh. Round two. Ah! <laughs> Whatever. It's fine. Oh yes, the bees. <laughs> You're gonna like it. You're gonna like it, Polly. <laughs> I really wish I could shake trees while I had my net out. It makes it like impossible to catch a fucking bee. Like, if there's people nearby, and you talk to them while you're being chased by bees, they just freak out. <laughs> hey, Boris. Wow, dude, you suck. Let's go talk to Bob. Bob the cat. Ah, Bob. You're a real disappointment, Bob. Damn it, Bob. You suck. Fish? Fish! Wow. He just went right for it. No holding back. Carpal tunnel. Ah uh, ah uh, ah. Uh. Mm. <laughs> I love the puns that they have when you catch fish. Great.
fish. Alright, Mr. Fish. It's not cool, man. There we go. Nailed it. <laughs> My red snapper spree ran out. <laughs> no! <laughs> Probably a sea bass. Yep, I don't. I wouldn't see a red snapper like uh, going out of his way for a rod or a bobber, whatever you call it. <laughs> it's kind of funny how you can, like, if you fish enough in this game, you can kind of understand like how each one like acts, so to speak. It's kind of interesting. catch a fish just like as it bites as opposed to it going fully submerged we'll find out nope 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 Wait, Mr. Fish! He's red. <laughs> I bet, dude. <laughs> I'm getting at? Do you, do you know what I'm saying? Are you picking up what I'm putting down? Are you catching what I'm throwing? <laughs> I need an apple. Apple! Dude, seriously? There's so many cockroaches out and about today. Oh. 
Okay. Hmm. I think of a good one. Whatever. Yeah, Everlast, that sounds like a really odd combination. Like, everything's just intense, and you have just, like, this really mellow music in the background. It's like, alright, everybody, we just, we just need to chill. <laughs> Dude, the greatest thing about this game is the fact that they pull out your letters later on, and then, <laughs> and, like, they just show it to you, and they're like, oh my god, I'm so happy about getting this, and, like, most of the time, I'm just trash-talking them. <laughs> I remember, I just got the warm fuzzies when I got, when I got your letter for the first time, and I reread it all the time, and sometimes it'll just, like, I, one of my letters was literally, like, quack, quack, motherfucker. <laughs> Makes me laugh, makes me chuckle. <laughs> it's the best. Yeah, like check check out um because they don't they don't read anything, like actually read it, they just hold on to the information. So like Nook yeah, Nook got me to like advertise his shop and this is what I came up with. <laughs> Like, I love having, like, having fun with the messages in this game. Because <laughs> it doesn't matter. Like, it doesn't actually matter what you put on there. Like, if they could somehow magically have some sort of, like, filter, where they could kind of get the idea of what's happening, um, <laughs> they, um, that'd be cool. And then, like, they would read kind of, like, what's going on and be like, what the fuck, man? <laughs> that'd be the best. Yeah, no, I know. There's there's no code parsing through it. Yeah, that would be it would be really difficult. Like that's probably why they don't do it. Like it would take a decent amount of processing power for how intricate it would have to be. I guess like they could make it really simple. Well, but then their answers probably wouldn't make sense. So yeah, like it'd just be too complicated, honestly. Yeah, but like then things could be taken out of context because they'd only look or look for like a single word <laughs> and that sort of thing well but that's the thing is like if you make it too simple like i was saying you could it would be messages taken out of context and they just get mad at you for no reason yeah that, that's the thing is like you could get away with just avoiding all those problems altogether. Fly away. Ah, oh, yes. Yes. 
Yeah, but that's the thing, is like, then it comes into it like, to a business sort of perspective, where it's like, do we want to invest this much time and resources? And not even like resources as far as like computing power, but like manpower and figuring out good ways of doing it. Is that worth it? And I, I, I would assume that it's been no, because I don't think they've changed it for any of the games. I love how I just have a shit ton of plants in my house now. I like never put plants in my house typically, but nowadays I'm just like, fuck it. <laughs> I like plants. Yeah, that was what I was thinking of as well. Where it's like, in order for them to be happy with the way that they would implement it, they, um, they probably didn't have enough to go about it. And plus, they could allocate that processing power to more... Or things that would be better overall in the game. Because realistically, like, not many people... They probably didn't know this at the time of this game, just because this was the first one. But I don't think many people write letters. Croton? Is that another plant? Dude, I am loaded with plants. That's kind of funny. Alright, let's check out this guy. Yeah, it's a plant. Um, I don't think I like this one as much as I do this one. Let's put this one right there. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, check that out! Actually, let's let's put it let's put it by the window. It needs light. Ah, oh, shit! I'm gonna have to move all sorts of things. Yeah. I don't know about all that, but it looks nice com considering what it is. What's really funny is that these things are just two-dimensional images. Like it's literally just a picture. <laughs> That's it. You can notice it a lot more when they abandoned the acres and where everything's just kind of open. Oh, that was another thing for Wild World that they did for the first time was that it was... They didn't have the acres and it was just one big area. I thought that was pretty cool. Yeah. That's how everything is. Like, it's all textures. Absolutely. Look real quick and see if I have my cord and Game Boy floating around to see if I can do the um, the island stuff because I really want to do that. So uh, hold on a second. You'll still be able to see me, but I won't be able to read what you're saying for a bit. Actually, I can just bring it over here. goodie bags basically like I have like all my old cases and stuff <laughs> and this is my 3ds box <laughs> I don't think this has any cables in it though 
Oh god, here's a fucking throwback. Oh, there's my Game Boy. Need that. Um, but yeah, like, this. Like, Game Boy Color. <laughs> Game Boy Color still fucking works. And then, like, all of the original Pokemons. Those three, and then... Gold, Silver, and Crystal are in here, too. BAM! <laughs> Anyways. Some nostalgia going on over here. Um... Amazing I have all this old shit. <laughs> nope. Stop. This thing's still alive. Oh my god, it has battery. <laughs> Whatever. It's gonna work. I'm gonna make it happen. Oh, I can't even charge it while it's on it anyways. Alright. Let's see how this works. Yeah, I, I apparently have two. I forgot I had a second one. Um. Hmm, come by the dock. supposed to do. It's been so long. Mm. I have to enable it. I mean, it should just be a regular... PBA? Allow access... Okay... Let's try this... Again... Yeah, that's what I tried. I don't know how it'll work as a, um... Because I'm using the GameCube adapter to plug this into it. Go 
Go ahead and make it two acres. <laughs> New hour. Make sure it's all connected, good and proper. How's it green now? What the hell? <laughs> it's so weird. Seem like um, it wants to connect. I honestly have no idea how it is a green battery though. It was blowing my mind. Oh, it's back to red. <laughs> of course. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, but I wasn't 100% sure, so I was just checking. can't do that. <laughs> There's no way I'm doing that right now. So apparently the way you have to do it is you have to basically run an emulator. Or I, no, I think that was... That was probably just creating the game itself. Yeah, I don't know. Oh well. Not that big a deal. Kinda makes me sad though. I really wanted to play on the island. Alrighty dude. Well, thanks for coming out. It was good talking with you. Hope you enjoyed. Nice. <laughs> Glad to hear it. I think I might hop off of Animal Crossing for now. Alright dude, yeah you do the same. 
for sure. Yeah, I think I might go ahead and hop off as well. <laughs> kind of, uh, hit my limit as far as, like, stuff I can do. Or at least for today. I don't remember how to get cherries and stuff like that. Maybe one of these days I can, uh, put in all the cheat codes to get all the Nintendo stuff again. <laughs> it's pretty cool. I might have to look into, um, getting... New Leaf as well. I really enjoy New Leaf. Like, I really like this game, but it pretty much serves its purpose as, like, the beginning of an empire type of thing. Like, it was excellent back in the day, but there's so much, like, more content now that it's, it's almost hard to go back. Though, it definitely is still fun. It's just, it's not on par to what's available nowadays. Plus, I'm playing it the way it should be played, <laughs> which is like per day, or at least I'm trying to for the most part, um, which is kind of limiting what I'm able to do as well, but yeah, so I think I'm going to hop off of here. Um, I don't know, like I may play something else, I don't know, I might just call it a night, honestly. Um, but yeah, for those of you that watched, I uh, hope you enjoyed yourself, hope you had a good time. Uh, if you're watching this after it's recorded, I might go ahead and upload this stuff to um, YouTube, I'm not sure yet. But, um, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Um, hope you guys have a good rest of your night, rest of your day, whatever time it may be where you're at. And uh, I will see y'all later. So, uh... Bye bye now. Bye bye now. We're gonna walk inside. We're gonna walk inside. We're gonna walk inside. Oh. And that's it. And we're out. Alright, bye bye now.